So we are back with Gripple, a adventure mystery puzzle game, also a series of books. We'll be getting back into this one. Last time we didn't have the smoothest run, a lot of problems, much like our second time, but may the third time be a charm. We are actually with the U.S. Department of Puzzle Research with the FBI. A joint DOJ-FBI venture. Starting off with our $3,500 pencil sharpener. Thank the American taxpayer for that. Probably another, another smooth thousand for the cup of bubblegum. Bowl of bubblegum. I think it was like, it was some exorbitant amount of money that the U.S. government spends on rubber bands. The U.S. Post Office, they spend, forget, they spend multiple millions of dollars on rubber bands every year for the U.S. Post Office. There is so much bloat in our government, it's out of control so much tax dollars that are used inscrupulously. Very 90s vibe to this game. So our first puzzle, crossword puzzle has been ripped to bits. Is there something written on it? Reconstructed. Okay, let's get all these pieces out of the way. Going to old Scoggins. We're a little, we're a little bit ahead of the game. The sense that I've done this. This will be the third time now. But they actually do kind of randomize it a little bit. It is a little mixed up. Right? Send it. Going to Scoggins. Scoggins, Illinois, Massachusetts, Minnesota. I forget. We'll find out soon enough. There we go. Sh shining example. Shining example of government excess. Beautiful uh, puzzle execution. Research. This is Agent Tethers. I, I think you have the wrong number. Oh, I see. A an assignment. In the field? No, no, sir. It's it's just it's been yes, quite some time. Uh huh. Erasers. The foundation of democracy? Oh, absolutely, sir. I agree, sir. Oh, yes, the White House needs its erasers, sir. I'll be on the next plane to... Wait. Good old Scoggins. Good old Scoggins. Where is it? I don't know. Illinois, Minnesota, Nebraska, New Hampshire, Massachusetts. One of those. Just arrived in Scoggins, Minnesota. Minnesota. Population 754. Temperature. Mm, it's cold and not much to look at. According to the agency, there's some kind of situ in si thing going on at the local eraser factory. The whole plant is shut down. 
There's a weird man staring at me. Hopefully, this won't be a big waste of time. <clears throat> Agent Tether's out. I have no idea where my hotel is. I might have to ask for directions. What hotel might that be? Baldus? Because you might be right outside of it, my friend. Excuse me. I'm Nelson Tethers with the FBI's Department of Puzzle Research. Hello? Yep. Okay, and you are? Bjorn. Bjorn? Yep. Nice to meet you, Mr. Bjorn. Boy, those snowmobiles sure are a bumpy ride, eh? Yep. Can you give me directions? How much of a talker are you? Hotel? I'm having a little trouble finding my way around. You'd never get there. Roads are too slick. Sir, I'm an agent of the FBI's Puzzle Research Division. It can't be harder than the puzzles I see every day. Not so. It's really just a, a matter of trajection. Okay, on the way to the hotel, you're going to pass two traffic lights. Nelson's snowmobile is sliding along the roads. Arrange the logs to help Nelson bump his way to the hotel. Make sure to pass the traffic lights Bjorn mentioned along the way. Alright, drag the logs from the menu onto the screen. Detours. Make sure they're arranged so that. Yeah. Alright, we did this one. Gotta send them up. Send them over. There we go. Bong bong. So ding, ding, ding. Ding, ding. Send them back. Should be it. Again, another puzzle we're familiar with because we already did this one. Getting into our uh, first play around. Another cool 75k. Poof. Up in smoke. Now, the resolution that we got. Alright, it looks okay. There is a little bit. A little bit being cut off, but we're not losing anything. What do you know? <laughs> I think that'll be a recurring theme. Uh, must have gotten lost. Very prudent use of tax money. Taking me to the hotel. They did. Uh, <laughs> I'm standing in front of the hotel, aren't I? Yeah. Thanks a lot. Welcome. Yeah. Oh, you didn't ask. It's not his fault. I didn't ask more specifically. Seen any suspicious people hanging around the hotel lately? Yep. Really? Can you describe them? Skinny. Asks lots of questions. Wears a stupid hat. Thanks for the tip. Yep. This excessive ride, it's crazy. Pay for the service that's supposed to be taking you places and they don't even show up. Then they have the balls to call you for your, your return trip. It's like, dude, I didn't even get go there. And now you're gonna call me with the return trip. Hotel's going to close soon. Better check in if you're sticking around. 
Like, it's a good analogy for what's going on in this game. It's pretty ridiculous. Just tons of tax money. And I've even talked to the people who do the, the driving for Accessoride. They make 60% of the money for just showing up. So, they don't even hear we go again. Hello? Uh, no, don't worry about it. The, I'm not there because nobody, nobody came to pick me up earlier. Yes, cancel. Thank you. Bye. It's unbelievable. Inspect the fence. Discovery oh my fence. god. Boards all chewed up something terrible. Could be Hello. the work of strays trying to get to the dumpsters back there. I don't know why I'm reporting this. Yes, you can cancel the ride, please. Uh, it's, um... Thank you, bye. Jeez. People are out of control right now. Out of control. That's the thing, man. You know, you pay your taxes. These things are supposed to be like a, a, an entitlement, you know? You're supposed to receive these things, they're supposed to work. It's just not the case. Well, these are interesting. Yeah, those are Skagen's gnomes. All the tourists love them. But I think one has gone missing. I swear, I had six of them. I took a picture when I set it up, but I guess I lost it. I still have the film negative, though. So you had to finish what I was saying, though. So, the people who do the accessoride, when they show up at your house, they could be an hour late. They could be 30 minutes early. Doesn't matter. They get 60% of the money that, that, the, that they're paying for the ride total. So these people, they show up early or they show up late. They almost never show up on time. Meanwhile, you're, you're always scheduling them for like doctor's appointments, like serious stuff. And they don't care because they get 60% of the money just for showing up at your house. So they don't care. A ceramic gnome has disappeared from the hotel display. But which gnome? Identify the gnome in Martha's photo negative that doesn't appear in the display. But now we get to be the, the part of the, the people we despise. We get to be part of the government. So we're, we're on the good end. You can't beat them, join them, right? So what the hell are we doing here? Negative gnomes. Okay. Okay. And what are we doing here? What? Okay. I don't want a hint, I just want you to explain to me what the hell we're doing here. Are we just selecting the one that's not the same? So it's supposed to mimic this, or it's the, it's the negatives. Okay, so it's supposed to be the opposite. Mm. Uh, I'm gonna take a hint just so I get put on the right track here. Like I'm not even sure what they're asking for. The negative of red is green and vice versa, since there are only two green-headed gnomes left in the store display. The missing one must be red-headed in the negative. The missing gnome. We're looking for the missing gnome. And it must have a red hat. So. Bottom row. legs. Both have red legs. That one. 75k. 
rejected. That's not the the missing note. Oh. Okay, we both have green. Oh, I feel like it's gotta be one of these. But those have green. What? The negative of red is very bad. my guess you getting rejected oh my god dude <sighs> honestly man I don't know with simple things like this I feel like I am half an idiot this is crazy I mean isn't there only one red red hatted left to pick Three for three? <laughs> Rejected? We, we won't even make a guess? I don't know. We'll, we'll give that a shot. 226,000, baby. 227k. I mean, honestly, this is pretty fair government work right here. Just wasting tax money, not even getting the job done? Sounds about right. The missing gnome, dude. So blue, uh, green, red, green. Green, red, green. So we got green, red, green, boys. Going left. So the negatives would be going to the right. That's why I just did. They're not giving enough con like background supporting info here. And I picked the three red ones and got rejected every time. So what the hell are you talking about? Like, what is that hint even talking about? The image in the negative might be a mirror image of the original. It'd be wonderful if you just tell me exactly what you're looking for. You're trying to find... The missing one in the negative. So they're going left, left, left. They're going right, right. Green, red, green. That's red. Green, red, green. Green, red, green. The one on the left. Green, red, green. Is it this one? I'm just like. I almost. <laughs> to be defeated by this? so early on is is an absolute this is a life changer right now my life is changing before your very eyes I just can't I just what, what the hell are you asking me for though I can you can't even see all the hints together the two green-headed gnomes in the display are facing different directions, but their bodies are identical. Two of the red-headed gnomes in the negative had identical bodies, but the third is different. <sighs> but I selected all of the red hat gnomes, and therefore, it cannot be any of them. Reset.
This dude's looking to the right. They're looking left. What? So you're asking me to find the one that's not the same here, basically. Just unbelievable. So we have to do this by process of elimination. Red. That's green, red, green. Left. Green, red, green, left. Green, red, green, left. So it's not him. Green, red, green, right. Oh my god, and the arms are going different ways. I don't even know if this is like a cognitive test. This is more like grab a piece of paper and just... So if I was going to eliminate him, he's looking the same way. But that's technically this dude. And then the other guy looking the other way. Green, red, green. Arms, bones. So these two are there. This guy. And this dude is the same as this dude. Yeah, red, green, red. But he's going the other way. So I need one of these to have their arms different. Just this guy. But he's looking left. Just trying to keep up with this in your head is crazy. Talk about getting a hint, man. Where you want chat to save you. Nobody's with me here. This is exhausting. I'm gonna get rejected. Yeah, I'm looking pretty hard, dude. This is the stupidest puzzle I've ever seen in my life. Raised. We not pick this dude? gonna spill through up to half a mil. Half to half a million. It's not. We're good. Yep. You can't you actually cannot get this 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 right. Actually impossible. We tried the red hat once. It's not them. Just don't don't get. It. How do you give somebody a puzzle without explaining what the objective of the puzzle is? This is crazy. Not starting off good, Grickle. a milli right now spending a milli i'll go through them all again and you could reject me on all of them i mean you made the game i don't understand who knew that you could get it wrong seven times when there's six possible answers here don't tell me approved we picked that one! That's crazy. Nine! Nine wrong answers, dude. Well, one of your gnomes has most definitely run off. Oh my, wouldn't that be something? <laughs> this is hilarious.